We tend to regret the things we do in the short term, but in the long term, we tend to regret the things we don't do. It, it, it basically, the, the, the ghosts that haunt us most in long life is things we never went for. You know, not now, you know, as you go older, you can, you know, yeah, yeah, that was really good of me. I'm going to pat my back. Yeah, how did, it ended in disaster, but I'm really proud of my former self for having done that. You know, it, 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 or, um, and this goes from everything from failed relationships to, you know, failed business ventures. You can feel a little bit kind of like, yeah, you know, it didn't work out, but, you know, I went for it. Good for me for trying. It's the ones you said, I didn't even go for it. And that seems to linger. Um, for example, Brian May from Queen. What's he known for? Aside from Fat Bottom Girls. Okay. Make the rock and roll go round. No one knows that one. It's a good song. <laughs> what else does he know? He went back after 30 years to get his PhD in astrophysics. Yeah, that's right. Why would he do that? You know? It was personally important for him to actually get that. There's actually um, 10 um, genuine uh, rock stars with PhDs out there. Which is kind of unfair, you know. <laughs> rock star and PhD, come on. <laughs> anyway, so, um, but it's the idea here is that you're here because this is important to you.